بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين. Today, my dear students, we are going to have a conversation in Unit Two. Here in this conversation, we are going to listen to two friends. They are talking about one of them. His parents gave him a sum of money for his graduation. Okay. And he is thinking what he will do with this sum of money. He have a lot of ideas, and he is discussing these ideas with his friend. Now we are going to listen. Then we are going to discuss and have some new vocabulary to talk about. Okay, listen. My parents gave me thirty thousand reals for graduation. Wow! What are you going to do with all that cash? I don't know. I'm going around in circles about it, driving myself and everyone else crazy. At first, I was going to do something really indulgent with it, like take a vacation. I was ready to book it, but then I got cold feet. Why? I think vacation sounds like a great idea. You've worked really hard for four years. You deserve a break. That's true, but on the other hand, I don't want to spend all that money on something that will be over in a week. So then I was thinking of buying something useful, like a used car. That's a good idea. Yeah, it would be a great convenience to have a car, but at the same time, I'm used to taking public transportation. And I really don't mind it. Frankly, I can't think of anything that I really need. So maybe I should put the money aside for a rainy day. Well, yes. I suppose the alternative would be to just put it in the bank until you need it. Right. But then again, what's the point of having money if you're not enjoying it? Maybe I should do something indulgent with it, like take that vacation. Now I see how you're driving everyone crazy. Now, after listening to this conversation, we are going to discuss some uh, new vocab and some expression that we have noticed in the conversation. The first one here is cash. Cash means money. Okay. The second one: go around in circles. Go around in circles when you have many possibilities and you cannot come to a decision. You cannot make up your mind. Okay, so this means go around in circles. Drive someone crazy means you annoy someone to a great extent. Ah, it means greatly annoy or irritate. Okay. Get cold feet to decide not to do something because you are too scared because you are too afraid to do that. Okay, so this means get cold feet means you are afraid to do something. Don't mind. Don't mind means not annoyed or bothered to do something. Okay, it's okay. Don't mind means it's okay. No problem. The last one, put something aside for a rainy day. This means to save or to reserve something, especially money, and it in this case usually money for a future need. You can, if you don't need it now, you can need it in the future. So put it aside for a rainy day. Okay, that's the end of our lesson today. Thank you and good.